All right, here we go, everybody. Jason Kendrick. Thank you. Thank you. So, do you guys mind if we get real for a little bit? Thank you. So I want you to think about this world that we live in. Where is the richest place on the planet? It's actually the graveyard, because that's where all of the dreams, all of the books, all of the songs, all these inventions that haven't been invented, that's where they go. Because we're too busy trying to fit in. We're too busy trying to do things that aren't really about us. So yeah, today is my birthday. I turned 42 today. Thank you. Thank you very much. I didn't do that for applause. I really kind of did it to show you why I'm thinking about this shit. Because I'm about 40. All of my life, I've kind of felt like an outsider, an outcast. I felt like an alien on this planet. And mainly because of my training. You know, that's, this, we live in a society and a world that shames. We are shamed into fitting in. We are shamed for, about, for being ourselves. And I've realized that I've lived in a shame bubble the majority of my life. And so I was shamed for being myself, and so I tried to fit in. And by being shamed for being myself, I ended up lonely, depressed, having thoughts of suicide. And so I thought, well, maybe I'll fit in. I'll give it the good old soldierly try, and I'll you know, be the good boy. And then what I realized was even fitting in or doing what I'm supposed to do, I ended up still being bullied ended up still being shamed, and I ended up realizing, after all of this, and after finally getting some age and some wisdom and some study under my belt, that fitting in is all about shame. You get shamed to fit in, you get shamed if you don't fit in, and then you shame yourself sometimes just because you don't fit in. So don't fit in. Just because you can doesn't mean you should. Fitting in is a social disease because of this. Because what we need now is less shame, more authenticity. Have you guys caught a theme tonight? <laughs> we need to be more ourselves and more ourselves with everybody. It's time for us to get rid of shame and bring back love and belonging and connection. We all want to fit in because we want belonging. Belonging is the reason we try to fit in, but fitting in is actually the antithesis of belonging. It is literally negates all belonging. So fitting in, no good. Belonging, good. That's, it. that's, that's basically my talk right there. <laughs> but it starts with us. You know, it starts here. Thank you, Meg. It starts here. So we were all meant to stand out. None of us were meant to fit in, and there's a reason Nature is not stupid. Every one of us has a genius inside of us that is waiting to come out. That genius needs to come out. We all need to shine our light. Shine your light for everyone to see because the more you shine your light, you will actually find those people you actually belong with. And I know that's one of the things why I do this, why I'm standing up here, because I'm looking for my people. When you find your people, you play your role. And as each of us play our own role, we actually find a society of geniuses. So please, be different. Be yourself, whatever that is. Einstein said that if you judge everybody on the same scale, you're basically missing the whole point because if you judge a fish for climbing a tree or a monkey for swimming. So please, don't end up here with your dreams, with your skills, with your genius left unexposed, left inside. Once you actually come out, shine your light, be the genius that you are, you will find your tribe and you can share that together. We can create a community of unity, of partnership, and of peace, hopefully. Please shine your light. Please be the love in the world that starts with yourself. Love yourself, love those around you, 
And please, for God's sake, stop fucking fitting in. That works. That was for emphasis. Thank you.